In this video, I'm going to tell you my top three choices for casting sites, the place to go to find auditions for acting. Whether you're brand new to the industry or have been cooking in the kitchen for a while, you need to be on casting websites. If you have an agent or a manager, they're going to require you to be on certain sites. If you are self-submitting yourself, that means you don't have representation, but you want to be in the room for those auditions. These are the sites that you want to use to make sure that the casting directors can see who you are, see what you can do in hopes of bringing you in for an audition. I think you're supposed to go backwards for these, right? So number three, my third choice is Backstage.com. It is a fantastic site and quite the resource for people who are just starting out in acting. There are tons of articles from well-known people in the industry explaining what it is that they do and answering any questions that you might have about what you want to do. On that site, you'll find a lot of independent films, student films, industrials, low budget acting opportunities. My number two choice is Casting Networks. This is a site that you want to be on. Your agents and managers will probably require you to have an account on Casting Networks. It's a great place for you to find principal roles, extra roles, commercial roles. The possibilities are endless. My number one choice for a casting website is Actors access. I love Actors Access and nobody's paying me to say this. I mean, I love Actors Access because I get money from Actors Access because there are jobs on there and it's amazing. It's a great resource. Actors Access has always been in the lead when it comes to submission sites in the industry and it is still very much killing it. If you are serious about acting and modeling and you have a resume and a reel and you on paper look professional, this is the site that you're gonna do the best on. There are plenty of opportunities on Actors Access. Now, with both Actors Access and Casting Networks, you won't see as many opportunities as there really are in the industry because we have a limited view of what is casting. The agents and the managers are gonna see more than we can see. And again, if you have representation, they're gonna require you to be on Actors Access. There's not really a choice there, but it is definitely my number one choice for auditions in the industry. If you wanna hear more about Actors Access, click the link above, take you to my video all about Actors Access. So. That's it, that's one, two, three, but I have a bonus. Can I give you a bonus? Here's my bonus. The bonus casting site is playbill.com. Now this is one of the sites that doesn't cost you anything. You can go on there and look at auditions all day long. You can look all day long, honey, it's fantastic. So anything that you see on there, you'll be required to send a personal email to the person that's casting for that thing. Please make sure to be professional when using this site. When you're sending an email, make sure that your email is clear to the point and makes you look like a professional because they only want to work with people who look professional. Playbill is very similar to Backstage. While Backstage has more of the independent film, student film situation, Playbill is going to have more of a theater aspect. So all of the Broadway shows have casting listings on Playbill. It's required. Because of the union for stage theater, it is a requirement that everyone can see the theater auditions. That includes Broadway, Off-Broadway. So you will see a lot of the auditions for those big shows on Playbill. Now, that doesn't necessarily mean you're ready to go and audition for that, but if you feel like you are, then go ahead. It would be a great opportunity for you to have. Now, what I've told parents in the past is if you're using Playbill and you're looking at it, and maybe you're looking at like the School of Rock auditions and you know your kid isn't ready, but they really wanna go, maybe you wanna go, take them, assuming that you're gonna audition, and then don't really audition, because they might get really scared and be like, you know what, mom? I think I'm good. But just going in there to see what's it like and see the energy of the space is really important and a really good thing to do. Too. Playbill is also great because there's an opportunity for you to read a lot of articles and see what people are saying. Any of the brand new news when it comes to theater is gonna hit there first. They're gonna discuss it. They're gonna tell you how everybody's feeling about it. Well, there you have it. That is my top three casting sites for actors. If you want a little bit more information about any of those sites, I have a playlist made just for you with 
more in-depth information on each site. Again, that was Actors Access, Casting Networks, Backstage, and then your bonus was Playbill.com. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. Let me know in the comments below what's your favorite casting site. As you know, my number one is Casting Networks. If you disagree, let me know. Tell me which one should we be on? And if you know of other casting sites that I didn't mention here, please be helpful. Add them in the comments below. As always, wishing you love, light, and all that jazz.